Guidelines were recently updated for the first time in decades to expand access to weight loss surgery, which has shown to reverse many obesity-related health issues. Barb Consiglio has that story. Maritza Cruz Rivera didn't think she'd ever dance like this again. Just a year earlier, she was living with constant pain and fatigue. I reached a point where it was either stay stuck, depressed, very sick, or live. How are Saludos, you? Doctor. Maritza was referred to Dr. Andre Teixeira, who ultimately performed bariatric surgery at Orlando Health, something he says is extremely effective in treating obesity and related health conditions, but is drastically underused. You know, the, the, the public perception sometimes think that bariatric surgery is only for patients that have super high BMIs or they are 100, 200, 300 pounds overweight, right? That's not true. It's misconceptions and stigmas like these that keep many patients from the treatment they need. Today, I walk better. A national survey by Orlando Health finds nearly 80% of Americans believe bariatric surgery should only be pursued as a last resort. And three in five believe surgery is a shortcut to shedding pounds, something Dr. Teixeira says couldn't be further from the truth. To me, that's not the easy way out. Very few people have the courage to do so, right? Is you facing that you need help. The survey also found over 60% think diet and exercise is enough to lose weight. But doctors say surgery helps kickstart those lifestyle changes necessary to maintain weight loss and live a healthier life. You have to change how you live, how you eat, how you interact with food, how you interact with other things. I can do things that I didn't do for over 20 years and, and survive it. <laughs> At Orlando Health, I'm Barb Consiglio.